guys, this is Hourcraft, and welcome to a very special video. Today is March the 3rd, of course. Right next to me, right here, I have a big box. Um, don't actually know if it's the Switch, I hope it is, otherwise uh, this would make a very, very silly recording. But hopefully in here, we should have the Switch and the Breath of the Wild Special Edition. Uh, Pre-ordered it for today, had a couple of problems. Like yesterday, with how it was being sent and stuff, it said like uh, Espace delivery Tuesday or Wednesday next week. Uh, it's like four or five days away, which would have been very upsetting, but it's here. Uh, so my complaint that I sent to Nintendo is no longer valid. So I guess we'll, we'll start off here. Look, look at this. Yeah, it's broken. Look at that. Look at all this. That probably really hurts one's headphones, and I'm sorry. Well, okay, so, first of all, let's pull this over here. This is what comes with the, um, the pre-order bonus, or I guess just the special edition bonus uh, for Breath of the Wild. It is a, a, a Sheikah Eye t-shirt, and I hope this fits. Um, that's cool. There you go, Breath of the Wild, there you go. Good news, it's fixed. There we go. Well, now we are in our proper attire for this unboxing. So I think we're going to start off with the Switch itself. Here it is in all its glory. Uh, there you go. I don't know if you can see this very well, but yeah, there's the back. There's what's inside it. There we go. Uh, so there's the size as well. None of the games are actually shown, just people playing it. Different approach to the uh, Wii U uh, one. Oh, okay, okay, here we go. So I did get the neon set uh, because I thought that looked a lot cooler. So, uh, okay, here we go. Here it is. Here is the Nintendo Switch. Um, now it's cold here in Britain, so there might be a bit of condensation on the screen. But there we go, that is a lot smaller than I thought it would be, actually. That is really small. We've got the kickstand here. You know, seen it, that video where I like, perfectly broke it off. Got the micro SD card slot. Got fingerprints all over it already. Uh, got a USB C charging port. Um, and then obviously that's where the Joy Con attaches. The power button and the two volume switches. And of course, that's where the game card goes. That is tiny. And headphone jack, of course. So uh, I'm just going to pull that up there. That's really small. I didn't think it'd be that small. But then, of course, we have these little beauties, the uh, the Joy-Cons themselves. Um, they're really smart, actually. They're, I have massive hands. Um, they are tiny. Oh my god. So, um, these are the Joy-Cons. Uh, we've got the red one, which I prefer. I prefer red over blue. I mean, I like this colour. It's a nice colour, but... Yeah, there you go. Let's put them onto the Switch here. Listen, listen to this sound. There you go. Um, this is actually pretty comfortable in this position. Um, yeah, there you go. That's what it looks like full. Let's put the kickstand back up. Uh, there we go. Okay. Uh, that's the first layer. Gone. Okay, next layer. This is the um, grip for them. Um, so let's try it out. Uh, here. Okay. Left one's a little bit more tricky to get off because I'm like, uh, oh wow, this looks really nice. This is a really nice finish on it. All right, that that's got a really nice feel actually. The this is the uh, Joy-Con grip. The Joy-Con's in. There you go. That was pretty. That was pretty sweet. That um, actually. Um, I'm feeling I might have to get a pro control because my hands are like really small. Uh, one thing that I forgot to show off is that. Uh, here you go, the, you got the two little buttons there, um, which you can use as a little controller. That's that just that's not that bad actually. Not not you know that's not that bad. I'm gonna put that back in there though. There we go. It looks like the dog. I guess the grey one kind of does look more like a dog, but we've got a multicolored face dog there. So uh, yeah, okay, so, there we go. Then what's next? Ah, yeah, we have the dock. You've probably seen a lot of these switch. Unboxing videos by now, um, but I thought I got fingerprints on it. That is that's a very really nice finish actually. So this is the dock. That's where it goes in. Uh, you can pull that down. So we got 
all the stuff that goes there. Um, Alright, so I guess we'll try and put the switch in here. Look at that. That goes in a lot nicer than I thought it would. Um, I didn't think it would go in that nicely, but it kind of slides in. So we're going to try this out here for the first time. Um, so let's put these on and put it in here and then obviously that means it goes onto the TV and then you can pull these off okay there you go that uh, we're just gonna leave that there I'm pretty sure okay no no yeah we have uh, these two Joy-Con straps and these apparently make it a lot nicer to um, hold Joy-Cons um, so this is this one, if I can put it in the right. Oh no, okay, they're different. They can go on either one. So yeah, there you go. That's all, that is a lot more comfortable actually. Um, yeah, there you go, that's, and then we'll just uh, have a look at the other one here. Obviously got the uh, plus and minus buttons, that's how you recognize them between the left and, you got the little things there. And yeah, there you go. Um, they're a lot more nicer to press actually, those buttons. Uh, so that's pretty cool. And then, okay, so we have HDMI cable, of course, um, that's pretty standard, we sh should be getting one of those now, and everything, and then we have the uh, AC adapter, just uh, pull this out, there you go, uh, that's, that's the switch done, and that's my little pendant there, whoops, okay, so yeah, there you go, there's the AC adapter as well. And now we get on to the game that I have waited for for so long. Breath of the Wild. Oh my, look at this. Look, it's massive. It's a limited edition one, of course. Uh, we have... Oh, wow, that was, this is very nice, actually. Uh, so I don't know how much of this you'll be able to see. Uh, but let's have a look. Race to decide for the past. I think we are now ready. Ready to go what happened 100 years ago. It's obviously... I think it's the Great Deku Trees line. Uh, from the Switch trailer. We have fish there, with Link swimming, and uh, riding on, I think that's Epona. I know how to get Epona, so um, I'm gonna get Epona. Uh, then we have some moors, so that's a Hyrule Castle, it's a shrine, cooking, battling, surviving in the wilderness. Uh, fight for the future of Hyrule, there is Link and Zelda. Zelda putting the uh, Master Sword back in the pedestal, uh, and the weird camel guardian thing there. So this has only three things, while the American one has a lot more. Uh, this is a really nice box as well. Um, so let's get into this then. Uh oh, I have to use my scissors again. Where have they gone? There they are. Okay. There we go. We're, we're in. All right, so I'm not gonna open this because I know that there is some um, thing with it. Right, there's some spoilers in some of the names. Uh, but, okay, now there's, <laughs> uh, they're on the back as well. Uh, but yeah, I really do like the Means Canal Zero games, as you probably know. Um, at the moment, I don't know how to get into this. Well, CDs, I, I'm trying not to look at the back here, because all the songs are on it. Um, all the tracks. Uh, I don't know how to get in. Um, this isn't opening. Why is this not opening? Let's pull out the scissors again. There we go. There we go. That, that, that go, that get into it now? Okay. Come on. I'm gonna have to cut this part out. I can't open CDs. This is why CDs went extinct and are uh, now replaced by digital downloads. Okay, there we go. There's the sound selection. Um, oh wow, that is pretty beautiful. That's, I don't, that must be some concept art. Oh, okay. Um, oh wow, that's pretty nice. Uh, we got. I have a poster here of this post of this uh, art. That the reason I have this one is because my birthday is on the thirteenth of June, um, and when that was that that was released on the thirteenth of June, and that's really cool. It's one day before Breath of the Wild was like officially announced, uh, or like the main trailer at E3 and stuff. Um, so yeah, there we go. That's the sound selection CD. 
Here it is! Here is Breath of the Wild. It's the, um, the back is the same as the back of this. Pretty, yeah, I think, yeah, it's the exact same actually. Uh, just move some more stuff down here. And it doesn't have the camel on it as well. That's pretty interesting. Um, so I know that the people are calling this like a massive waste of plastic. Uh, and I can see why people say that because I have so much plastic on my floor right now. Um, here we go back to the center. Shopping. Oh my god, we got Breath of the Wild in our hands. Uh, now, I've been on school all day, um, and I had no idea whether this was actually going to be delivered. Um, so I had my phone on all day, um, asked my dad to text me if anything happened. Um, but yeah, so the Royal Mail, which is the one in Britain, um, did text to say... Ooh. Whoa! It's no longer a waste of space! And small that is. Also people are saying that it tastes really bitter. But I don't know whether that's true or not, but I don't really want to try it. Oh what the hell? No, that's, a, that's disgusting. What? What did it put on? Oh my god. Um, okay, so we have some nice out of the master sword inside here. I know that is definitely different um, than the American version. Uh, but yeah that's obviously different as well. Um, now, I didn't, like, I prefer this one, but obviously you can tell that because it's my channel art. But I think I've grown quite accustomed to this one, I don't mind it anymore. Um, I really like it. Uh, so, we'll just put that there. And then, we'll uh, open up the top here with these nice uh, Triforce symbols. Then we have this, which is the Master Sword of Resurrection figurine, uh, which is only in the Master Edition in America, uh, but it is just in the Special Edition here. And I really wanted the sound CD, so I might as well have gotten this one. Um, so let's just crack this open. Let me just get that up. There we go. Okay. Now uh, pull this out. Uh, I know they did unbox this in like a Nintendo Europe thing on YouTube because they watched that. Uh, they unboxed like the whole Breath of the Wild, um, the special edition. Um, I've seen that. There's no point seeing it now because you'll see this here. Oh wow. Look at this. This looks absolutely gorgeous. Wow. That was a loud bang. Okay, let's open this up. Oh no. What the hell? Okay, that's gonna have to be fixed. That's a shame. Well, that's meant to go there. Good, good quality. I guess that's just being some flowers. I probably should have been more careful. Okay, but yeah, here we go. We're missing the flower. This is probably the first one you're missing since that's happened. I think it's meant to go that way. But yeah, there we go. There is the Master Sword of Resurrection complete with. I can't remember what that's called. I think it's called like the Princess Flowers something. I don't know. Like the Sleeping Princess, I think it's called. But yeah, there we go. That's the Master Sword of Resurrection statue. And that's everything. Uh, so, watch out for tomorrow. I'm going to be playing Breath of the Wild tonight, of course. I'm going to pull the first episode of the Let's Play tomorrow. Um, so, I'm going to go and hook this up to my TV. Um, because that needs to happen. And yeah, I'm, I'm amazed at how small this is and how small the Joy-Cons are. These are tiny. Um, I, they're really small. Um, I have pretty big hands, granted. So that's probably why I'm going to get Pro Controller. Uh, but I'm just going to test these out for tonight, see how I feel, especially with the uh, Joy-Con grip. Uh, that's going to be my final decision. Uh, go to uh, game tomorrow. Um, pretty small, though. Um... Especially these buttons, like, I don't know if you can really tell, but these are really, really small, uh, these, these buttons. Um, so yeah, there we go. Um, I think it, it should fit my Wii U case. Yeah, it will, okay. Uh, so I did order a pre-order a case off game, but that hasn't come, so that's a shame. Um, so yeah, hopefully that'll come soon. I don't know what it's gonna be like, um, using these like hands separately. Like that, like the guy showed. Um, 
and they think that's probably going to be really weird um, just because like we're not used to that so like the last time it was like the uh, the Wii and Nunchuck Wii remote and Nunchuck um, and still like the this still didn't have much so there's apparently some like connectivity issues with like uh, the signal from here um, on this one um, I don't know I think that's because like the bottom of the or something I don't know something to do with that but hopefully it should be fine um, so yeah I'm going to set this all up now and I'm going to leave this video look out for uh, first episode of Breath of the Wild coming out tomorrow I uh, hope you're excited for that I definitely am excited to start playing this game which we've waited for so long so, I hope you enjoyed. Do leave a like and a comment if you have. It's greatly appreciated. If you are excited for Breath of the Wild and the Let's Play, do subscribe as well. It is uh, greatly appreciated. Um, but, yeah, otherwise, uh, that'll be it for me. And I'll see you all next time. Goodbye.